All righty here. We got this version here into <laughs> the exit there. And then there is this version into the exit. Now, let's just quickly take a look at them, uh, both of those guys, side by side. All right, and here they are. So shot length will be a bit different, but we kind of see the difference. And it, cut, it cuts out at the end. So we have a beginning here where she's looking, going, whew, what's over there? On the left, I'm looking at this guy. And then exit, grab the gun and out. And then the other one on the right, she just does this, smiles immediately. And then it will be the out. So with this version, I'm going to actually zoom in again here. So we have a cut beginning where she goes straight into that thought process there. Ooh. It's almost like a fake out and then phew. okay. I think that works better. I know it's a smaller exchange, but it just adds just to me an extra layer of just the thought process of something. She's registering something. And then we wonder like, well, if this seems a bit worrisome because of that face, why would she just kind of smile and walk away? It's because it's a fake out. You got that slight moment of being a bit more serious, going into this, getting ready, but then getting the question is, is she, it seems like she is shooting and then it's the power of the weapon here that throws her away. That's my guess, right? It's been a while and I think that's what I remember and it's not her being shot at and then reacting to that. Looking at this here, I still think that the end is a bit fast. I do the I do like the rest that you have here. I think that's all cute. Like you said, it's still on twos. It's gonna be a lot of work to tame that hair. I think where we can push things a bit more is this is the only bigger exchange or smaller exchange where we see a little bit of a but it's it's this one here where she just has a squint and a head down into that. And I wonder. If this could be a moment that we go, where she goes, I don't know if there's time or if it will read, but something where maybe a tightening of this a little bit, a raising of the shoulder, just kind of a broader sense of tension and, all right, let's go into this. I'm just, my concern is that she sees this, goes into that, and then we're practically, you know, at that same level where she does all this, gets into this, and that's like, the lowering here, the change of pose and everything is, is because she has the gun. That's the surprise. And I wonder, can we get something out of this moment here that is different than this? Uh, a broader visual change in body language to get ready into this. Because she doesn't have to go that way up here. I know it's kind of a fake out, but it could be maybe like a slight change of a step as well. And with, you know, like, I don't know if she has to be hunched over and shoulders. I know you want to, you know, spoil it too much, but that's the only thing I'm, I'm wondering. Is that too subtle? You see it just enough in that change here, but maybe through here, like even more squinting. And I'm just wondering if, if, since it's so fast, could it work that we tilt her forward a bit more we have like a big shoulder raise and the head is almost buried in here you know it's almost like uh, like that shoulder is almost like a cape covering her and then you can still have a moment where she gets bigger here as an anticipation to go back down again and then maybe in here when she goes even that would still be in the squinty uh angry pose in the face so that here maybe that's a bit too much that stretch here but like maybe on that frame you open the face here the, the face could still be up with white eyes so basically we're going huh Ooh, what is this then yeah 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 it's all fine and maybe i mean i know i know you like the squinty or the uh, the raised cheeks because of the smile but then i wonder from here on that expression continues until 
until here. Like it's, it's a continuous tension, maybe shoulders up, evil eyes, and that impact here after she shoots. That's when those eyes open. And then they still open, so it's not such a huge drag here. And then the head will be down like that. And it's a small change, but I just want to make sure that we squeeze everything out that we can in terms of readability and contrast. Because that'd be picky. I'm still wondering, like, what is, what is this pose? What is she looking at? to get into this. Could it be something where this is almost like kind of action where she was just doing something? And could it be a bit more innocent where maybe maybe the pose is more like, oh, I'm just kind of standing here and, and, and looking at something. And, and then she goes, oh, what is this? But again, the, the legs could be already or could be down, not like this. And she, then she could bring out her hands, her arms. And then she goes, whoa, into that. And that might be a step back or the feet are still down straight. And then she takes a little shuffle step over and then into that, if that makes sense. That's my, my worry summed up basically is, what is this pose telling us? I understand this. That's a, that's a clear change. Maybe I'm also overthinking for a short shot like this. Do we need to really know what's here? Um, but that's the only thing. Or maybe, maybe she does something adjust her her sleeve or maybe she even has her hair around and she does something to her hair and looks down at her hair and suddenly goes oh what is this oh <gasps> and that you know then the hair kind of swings around might maybe or you still hold on to it because you don't want to distract from this we want to see and read that but that might be something that's like as a as a throwing out of an idea could she be doing something here instead of just looking through the emptiness here then into that that's fine that's fine too and then that moment here, push that moment and keep that moment till basically the impact. And even this here, I wonder if this is also a bit odd to get that. Is that too much? She's all happy, open eyes or now closed eyes. And then it's almost, almost squint serious, but then it opens up again and then squint serious. I'm also inclined to say, take this out and either keep those eyes closed, closed, closed until into this or you keep them have a blink then and then stay within this pose instead of that pose and that's kind of that hope that makes sense like little things here and there which of course you can always say nah i'm gonna keep whatever i have but these are just the thoughts and uh yeah let me know what you think all, all right, right. There's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.